Mother Nature has developed systems of maintenance that go far beyond complexity and understanding of humans. And it is the height of hubris to look at one little area and expect that you understand the system. People have an impact on the planet. There's no doubt about that. And some of the things that, that we've done as farmers were not the best. Um, so we're learning. Um, and it's taken us a long time to learn about soil health and about the fact that if we don't take care of the resource, it's not going to be there for the next generation. Farmers uh, are challenged in many ways, uh, certainly financially. This is an expensive place to, to grow, given the real estate values um, and, the, and the, the development. The whole operation is about maintaining the, the land, the biosphere, and finding ways to be able to afford to keep it uh, because it, it's expensive land. Uh, there's elements out there that would buy it in a heartbeat uh, for a lot of money an acre, and finding ways to raise crops that have high value. This is the way we can keep the land. So I would say that agriculture on Long Island is somewhat out of crossroads. There will always be agriculture here, but it won't be the traditional agriculture that we know today or that our parents knew. It's going to look entirely different. It's important to shop at local farm stands. In general, not just me. If you have one by you, you have to go shopping. Because if you don't support us, we're gonna go away, right? So you vote with your dollars. Every time you, you go to a supermarket to buy tomatoes, you're voting that, yes, I like these tomatoes from Florida that are grown, you know, with God knows what. If you shop here, you're voting for us. You're saying, yeah, we like what you're doing. And it helps keep the farms going. How everything is interconnected, I think, is the most important thing that people need to realize. It's not just, hey, food, that's a wonderful pork chop. It's all the way down to the environment, the, the, the happiness of that animal, the lack of suffering of that animal, feeding the soil, supporting the economy, whatever it is, that entire chain needs to be reflected, I think, with that one item that you're buying and recognize that you're doing something good for that entire chain. The challenges aren't going to go away, but as a community, we have to be committed to uh, helping agriculture stay here for all the benefits that it provides. 